Um, congratulations. If you look up where we're at right now, this gentleman is at uh, Muscle Milk Seidel Sport. He is sponsored six months ago, picked up a contract. And for all those watching, for, for the young men that are trying to look like you, do what you do, how do you sell it? I mean, looking like this is one thing, but how do you, how do you go to a manufacturer and say, hey, uh, attach me to your product, you'll sell more of it, and, I, and share the money with me? Well, the big thing is, uh, since being signed, the questions I get are, are just that. How do I get sponsored? How does this happen? Uh, basically, it, your personality has to show, and your hard work has to show. Uh, I was signed with Bybuild.com, and we just happened to have a booth right next to Cytosport, and they saw how hard I was running around and sweating, and that's how they got in touch with me. They just liked that I was a hard worker. So um, that's, that's how we got the, the, the talks going. Um, but you come to these expos if you're not signed or anything like that. Networking is the best thing to do. You know, you try to figure out who that person is uh, in charge of the sponsor teams and everything like that. And uh, you do your best to go ahead and just show them that you're not a Joe Schmo. That I'm just pretty, you know, that sort of stuff. They like goofiness. They like to know who the real you is because that's what's going to have a fan base. So basically, just be yourself, and that's the best thing that you can do. Oh, hell. I don't have very much personality. That's going to be hard. Okay. All right, moving forward. Um, you talked about... Um, one door opening into multiple doors. Mm -hmm. That's really neat. So you basically you picked up a contract with Bodybuild.com. Tell us a little bit how that happened, and then acknowledging I really like where you went with that, where you never know what door it is. When you sign, say, a supplement contract, and all you're getting supplements, you don't know if the next door is going to be the money. So tell me a little bit about, uh, excuse me, how Bodybuilding.com came around. Oh, I apologize. Uh, well, actually, it was a big surprise also. I, I didn't have a Facebook. I didn't have a MySpace. The only social media that I had was a body space, which is off of Bodybuilding.com. Wow. And uh, I'm in the military, so when I'm in the desert, the only social media I can update is my body space. Well, a majority of the things that you're doing in the desert is working out. So it was a great thing to do. I came back from Iraq, and uh, somebody from body space got in touch with me, actually from Bodybuilding.com, got in touch with me through body space. They said, hey, we're we're, we're doing a new campaign. We we love your look, your your attitude. We're gonna throw your name in there. Maybe you get chosen. Maybe you don't. A few minutes later, I got a call. They used me for a photo shoot. They didn't sign me or anything like that. I just got used for a photo shoot. Uh, and then after that, I flew my way out to the Olympia with my own money, you know, and just worked my ass, work my work my ass off. Sorry. Right. And uh, and that was that. Uh, from there, they saw my hard work, and then they just wanted to keep me. Beautiful. So. Okay. So what what we got from here today is. One door could open up into many, and if nobody knows that you're around, nobody knows who you are, if you don't put a picture on something as simple as a body space, they can't hire you. They, they don't know you're here. So thank you for your time, buddy. Thanks. I appreciate it. Good to see you.